The question, what kind of rash can fibromyalgia cause? Although not classically a symptom, it is fairly common for people to have a rash with fibromyalgia. But these tend to be small itchy red bumps. People routinely see several dermatologists with no clear diagnosis and none of the treatments working. When we treat with the antifungal diflucan 200 mg a day for 6 weeks, very often these rashes go away. 40 years ago, dermatologists called these ID reactions skin reactions to fungus at a distance. The infection is elsewhere in the body. Culturing or looking at the scrapes of the rash microscopically do not show fungus. But it seems doctors stopped using this diagnosis despite the treatment working. So dermatologists are unable to make the diagnosis. A different kind of rash are scalp scabs. Clinically, we find this to be a marker for underlying bacterial infections in fibromyalgia. When this is the case, both the scabs and the fibromyalgia often improve with Zithromax. There is no research on this, but having treated over 3,000 people fibromyalgia is something that we see in a small percent. Check out the link below for a guide on long-term remission or to join in with the community.